something you might not know about Canada. Most people who spend the day in bed are either sick, slacking off, or working in the adult entertainment industry. But none of those scenarios applied to John Lennon and Yoko Ono in May of 1969, when they hosted a bed-in in Montreal's Queen Elizabeth Hotel. Montreal became the chosen destination for the bed-in after the couple deemed the Bahamas too hot, and U.S. authorities denied John access to New York because of a previous marijuana arrest. All right, all right, all right. When a reporter asked John what he was trying to achieve, Lennon blurted out, just give peace a chance. And in the wee hours of the morning, people ranging from Timothy Leary, Tommy Smothers, and Allen Ginsberg were there when Lennon recorded, give peace a chance. The song hit number 14 on the Billboard charts and inspired anti-Vietnam War protests. Not bad for a marijuana user who spends his time in bed. The John and Yoko suite is still available, so you can stay there yourself if you've got $600 a night and a great idea for a song. And that's something you might not know about Canada.